Hi, welcome to Astrology Valley. Congratulations on picking the Death Zero card for your general reading today. I will share with you tips and tricks on how you can best utilize its energy. After the general reading, remember to click on the cards below to see the next aspect of your reading where you will get valuable insight for your love life, health, and finances. Stay tuned as I have special advice reading at the end. The Death card is ruled by the constellation of Scorpio, as you can see here with our two beautiful cards of Scorpio. And on this one, we have intensity, exposing, purging, and renewing. I would add to that intuition and emotion as well. So today is a day to tune into your intuitions and your emotions and perhaps purge anything that is no longer necessary. Scorpio rules the 8th house in astrology and it's a powerful house to release anything that is no longer serving us or is getting in a way for us to get somewhere new. Okay, so use the past as a fertilizer to create change and new opportunities because today they're an imminent okay the death card could be called change as well and people fear death card you know just because they fear change you know we are not really comfortable with changing we're more comfortable staying in status quo but change is sometimes needed in order to grow so welcome this card today because it is a big card and it's a game changer okay so since you got it in a general reading today it might affect any part of your life so the keyword is change so you can just apply that to any uh, part of your life so if you want to get a job and you're not employed this card suggests that you might get a job since that would be the change of status if you're working and you're not satisfied you you may decide to quit your job today or you might experience uh, someone else leaving at your job maybe some your boss or your colleague anyway some sort of change is happening today and uh, in your love life, again, if you're single, you might meet somebody new and change that status. And if you're together with somebody who you don't really have a healthy relationship with, maybe it's time to let that go. And uh, then again, if you are in a happy relationship, you can experience some Kundalini rising and some tantric sex and really raise the bar for intimacy with your partner. So anyway, change can be positive, you know, if you just like change your approach and appreciate it for what it is, because it, it is a rebirth, okay? So death um, is sometimes called a rebirth. So this is a really big, big card to, to have, you know, some sort of change is happening today and I hope you utilize it for the best. Also in your health area, if you were struggling with any kind of issue, that issue might come to an end today. You might finally find the antidote, find the cure. And um, if you want to improve your health overall, you can try with the detox. You know, Scorpio is um, excreting and ruling the digestive organs. So you can try intermittent fasting. You can try detoxing your body and also try implement a new healthy regime, okay? Since you have this energy, of death and change today you might as well implement it into what you want to create so what change do you want to create and start to actively work on it now i mean <laughs> okay so that's it for this video thank you for watching remember to click on the cards below to see the next aspect of your reading where you will get valuable insights for your love life health and finances i'll see you there